Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to apply time value money principle to solve problems related to money which includes four components present value, future value, time invested, and interest which period compounded. Let's go to our example. You just won the lottery and want to put some money away for your brother's college education. When your brother goes to college eight years from now, the cost will be $65,000. You can earn 9% compound monthly. How much you need to invest today? In this problem, we know 3 over 4 components. Future value is 65000 Period is 8 years. Interest is 9% per year compounded monthly. And we need to find the remaining component, which is the present value. Remember that we always have to translate the period unit into period unit that the interest is compounded. In this example, the interest is compounded monthly, so we need to translate period unit into number of months instead of number of years, and translate the annual interest into monthly interest. Now we come to the solution. First, list out the components that we are given from the problem. Next, translate period and interest into the period that the interest is compounded, which is monthly. Use financial calculator to enter the information. Then we get the result. You need to invest $31,724 today to have 65000 in 8 years for your brother's college education. We will have lots of similar problems, which ask you to find the last component when you only have 3 over 4 components. For example, ask you to find interest when you already know present value, future value, and time invested, etc. If you have any question, feel free to comment and I'll be glad to answer. Thank you for listening. Enjoy learning finance and see you next time.